10 p.m. and I have a salted caramel mocha frappuccino from Starbucks. So, welcome. My name is Cassie. I hope you're having a good day or had a good day wherever you may be in this world. Today I am unboxing my October BoxyCharm. Yes, I am extremely late. I know. I understand. Also, I hope that you appreciate my background and um, being in character for this because it is October, it's almost Halloween, I just filmed this look so I feel like it would be it would be very fitting for me to just keep this Beetlejuice look on. I will leave it in the description as well as up in the card above so you can check out how I got this look and how it turned out. I will right, we'll get into BoxyCharm, how I'm feeling about BoxyCharm, their new options, and all of that in the next few clips. Please subscribe if you haven't already because it is free and I upload twice a week, once on Wednesdays and once on Sundays. Except you will notice that this video is not on a Wednesday or Sunday because I skipped a day in October and I really wanted to film Halloween looks. So I decided to film some extra videos and put it outside, upload them outside of my uploading schedule. So you're welcome, but just make sure that you are subscribed. We're gonna and get right into it. Some of you are living under a rock anywhere in this world and have no idea what BoxyCharm is. BoxyCharm is a monthly subscription box. You receive nail polish, pretty much everything beauty, nail polish, skincare, makeup, hair care, literally everything. However, they have been starting to do some like I've been starting to do some like new boxy charms. So you get boxy luck with lux, which is every three months. Then you get the regular boxy, and then I think it's either boxy 2.0 or boxy premium or both. I don't even know, but they're doing too much and it's making me very frustrated. But basically, mine is the regular one from day one. It's $21 a month, and I think in December or November it's moving up to $25 a month. Okay, so I guess now you can select one item in your box every month, and I believe that's every seventh of the month. I haven't been able to do it. Okay, so it's BoxyCharm Premium and BoxyCharm Lux. The regular BoxyCharm is $25 a month. The Premium is worth over $340, and it's $35. For the box, you receive six to seven full-size products, free shipping, so you are charged $25 for box time plus $35 for premium. What? So if I'm getting this right, you pay $25 a month, and then when you get premium, you have to pay another $35. BoxyCharm. Get it together. Come on, this is... They're, like, spending way too much time on these open new boxes that they're just giving bad boxes. All right, Boxy Lux is, so you can upgrade every three months and it's a box of over $275 and you won't get the smaller box, you'll just receive that one. And you pay an additional $24.90. Oh, okay, I'm so confused. Just go on the box chart website yourself and check it out. I feel like everybody is confused. Sorry if my lipstick like bothers you, but I'm trying to drink this before I go to bed at 11 p.m. This is my BoxyCharm. I did leave a comment on their BoxyCharm saying that if they couldn't get it together and if these regular boxes at $25 a month when it moves up are just going to be like the leftover products thrown in the box, I will cancel my subscription and put my money elsewhere into a better place. Not Ipsy. Nah. But I like BoxyCharm. I don't know. Maybe I would look into something that's like natural. I don't know. Anyways, we're going to open up the box and this is what the box looks like when you first open it. So every box you get this boxy charm little thing right here and it tells you the products that are in it. This is a little bit different. Normally you just get a card and it'll say boxy charm. It'll have the theme and then it'll have the stuff on the back, but this is open so it says flip over for a bigger boxy charm. This is so the theme this month is After Dark, and I'm not going to read what I got. Um, okay, take a selfie. All right, here we go. Boxy Charm Premium. It's $35, over $175 a month um, in product. And then it says Boxy Charm 2.0. Better customization, more choice. Add-ons, Boxy Pop-Up. I don't know. In the Boxy 2.0, you receive concealer and foundation matched to your skin tone. So the first thing in the box, we're gonna go with this right here. This is the iconic London Prep Set Glow Setting Mist, I'm assuming, Water Mist Original. 
and this is worth $29 and it's a hydrating mist that refreshes with light reflecting properties that leaves the skin with Iconics Glow. The stunning multi-use spray can be used to prep the skin before applying makeup, set a finished look, or add a radiant gloss to a bare face and body. With extracts of cucumber and chamomile, antioxidants, green tea, caffeine, and vitamin E, this 100% vegan wonder spray helps to condition skin, combat the look of dark circles, and leave your skin feeling revitalized and glowing. Mouthful. So honestly, I was really, really bummed. I checked this box before I did this because I wasn't going to film, but I was like, you know what, I can't skip. I love doing box charm videos, but I was really bummed because they had the Paula's Choice skincare, and I always put on there that I would rather have skincare than have a gimmick product like this. I mean, really, who wants glitter all over their face? Am I wrong? Am I right? Or am I right? But for real, I don't know. If someone had said, I think it was Kathleen Lights. That she got the same thing. I was surprised. Oh, this smells like good, amazing. It smells like freaking shampoo. I'm gonna spray it on my face just because I'm gonna take this stuff off. So I'm gonna see what it does. Okay. That smells amazing. And it's a very good mist. On my arm, it's like really sticky. That's kind of tough because I do have glitter all over my eyelids which falls a little bit on my face so the glitter got a little bit everywhere but um I would, ugh, it smells good it has a good mist i don't see glitter yet i will definitely try it out but honestly i would rather have the paula's choice that's just a preference in my opinion and the next thing in the box is this right here and this is a dose of colors palette this i'm excited for i honestly have never tried anything dose of colors i don't even think i have a lipstick of theirs but this is um, Dose of Colors Eyeshadow Palette 5 Pan Matte Eyeshadow Palette with a mixture of shades. The palette is great to add boldness and vibrance to your eye looks, and this retails for $32. First of all, already the Iconic Spray is worth more than the box, but this is the one that I received, Sassy Sienna's. The packaging is absolutely beautiful, and I always, always hear amazing things about um, these palettes. So... Give the video a thumbs up if you would like to see a video using this palette. I do have stuff on my floor. It's the only way that I will remind myself of things to use from BoxyCharm. And I will definitely put this to the test for sure because I already want to. And it's mattes. So that's just my cup of tea. I think I showed my husband this and he's like, oh, mattes, your favorite. Like, good job, honey. You're learning. Next thing in the box is this product right here. Hank and Henry Slick With It Mascara Duo. This retails for $19. Says, Slick With It Mascara will have you feeling like you have major clout. This vegan mascara is not only waterproof, but it does not flake or transfer. The Duo One Applicator is designed to work with our formula for adding volume and length to your top lashes, while the other is thin and designed to easily add mascara to your lower lashes. I have like five mascaras open right now. I don't like to open mascaras if I'm not going to use it right away, so I am going to keep this closed. However, I went like this because it says it's waterproof and I can only use waterproof. So I'm actually really, really excited to use this. I'm going to put it in my drawer right now so that way I don't forget to use it and I can update you guys in a later video. And I like how it's double sided so you have one for your top lashes and one for your bottom lashes. The NYX, the skinny mascara or something like that is really, really good for the lower lash line. We only have a couple more things in the box. This is Hollywood and Vine. Hollywood and Vine Velvety Touch Smooth Coal Eyeliner. Line your eyes with the rich intensity of Velvety Touch Smooth Coal Eyeliner. The creamy formula glides on smooth and adds drama to any desired look. This is retails for $7.00. And this is in the shade black, so you can all you never go wrong with a black eyeliner, but I mean, I don't really prefer pencil liners. I like the ones that kind of just roll up on their own, like the retractable. And then the last item in the box is this right here. This is Mellow. Mellow Tinted Brow Gel, and it retails for $16. Says achieve effortlessly tamed and tinted brows with Mellow's Tinted Brow Gel, a lightweight, non-sticky for gel formula with a mini brush applicator allows you to finish and maintain a perfectly groomed eyebrow with no mess, perfect to use over powder or pencil. So I always really like using brow gels. The reason why I really love BoxyCharm is because you receive a bunch of products that I would never like try on my own so it kind of opens up my palette if you will so I feel like this would be really cool to use and you can always recommend it to other people. 
And I'm going to add up the entire value of the box. This month's box was worth $103 and I did only pay $21. So it is worth it, but honestly, if I'm being 100% honest, I'm a little disappointed in this month's box. Um, I do love receiving brushes, which I received last month, I believe. Um, but I feel like I would keep these four products, get rid of the Iconic London Spray, and rather have the Paula's Choice, just because I love trying new skincare. I love makeup, don't get me wrong, but trying new skincare is like... A weakness for me like whenever Ulta's employees have like oh yeah I have another episode coming you know come out in November I swear I have a whole like two pages worth of stuff to say so I'll probably split it up into episode two and three but um I love when Ulta has a 35% off for employees instead of 25% off and I go crazy because when I'm bored I'll like clean up the store and stuff on my side because I am a prestige beauty advisor so I'll clean up prestige make new testers all of that but I will also kind of like window shop so I'm like when we get that 35% off I'm like I want this this I get a few makeup products maybe like a new foundation or something like that but it's mainly skincare. Um, if you did watch my last Ulta haul, which was when we had the last 35% off, I spent a ton of money, but I also did get a really big discount, so that was great. And most of it was literally all skincare. So this box is going to go in the trash. Anyways, do you have BoxyCharm? Did you get the same exact products that I received? Um, did you get something different? Did you enjoy the box this month? Did you not enjoy the box this month? I had somebody comment on my last BoxyCharm asking me what the weight was. They asked me what the weight and dimension of my BoxyCharm was and I didn't answer because I was just like, okay, first of all, like, I don't have that information. And second of all, why? Anybody know? No, I'm like generally asking why would anybody want to know that information? Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Definitely leave me some comments down below letting me know if you did get Box Charm. Are you upgrading? Did you like this month's box? What did you get in it if it was different than mine? Please subscribe if you haven't already. Hope you enjoyed. Check out this video. It is literally 10.58 p.m. aka 11 p.m. on Monday night and I do not want to take this off. But the only reason why I did this is because today is hair washing day.